right, thanks for tuning in. I'm out here on a foggy, foggy morning. But this is the same area from the last video where I caught a big one on the top water. I just knew it would pay off. I'm, I'm going to fish it again. Anyway, stay tuned. Uh, it's been raining all week again. Uh, we've had some weird weather. But the water temperatures are coming down ever so slightly. Which helps. Based on the morning so far, I'd be better off if I put down the top water and headed up the creek. But I'm just kind of working my way back. Not seeing very much bait on the surface today, which is different. There. Oh, I missed him. That fish hit it when my lure was under the water. Wasn't working right for some reason. He... Oh well. At least we know they will bite. now pulling drag on me <laughs> I just love catching them on top waters oh he came off I didn't think I had a very good hook hook set on him darn it just refuse to give up on the top water just yet I don't know if this camera showing it but I got a stick up right there just a little Solitary piece of cover. And there he is. Oh, it is good lord. I think it's a large mouth. I don't want to lose him. First fish of the day is a good one. That's a solid. Ah, at least two and a half. Good fish. That's why I don't give up on the top water. That's a good fish just an isolated piece of cover. I mean, I love catching them on the jig and the worm, but I'd rather catch them on the top water. I'm here on a Friday. There's a big tournament this weekend, so I'm just trying to get it in while I can. I won't come near the lake with all the boats. But I like that. I like me some top water. Nice large mouth. Beautiful fish. Not what I'm looking for, but... All right, there we go. Come here, little fella. Just a little large mouth. <laughs> so my plan is to fish the top water until I get in around these backs of these docks. And then I'm gonna switch it over to either the jig or the worm.
put down the top water and picked up the worm. <clears throat> I've been throwing the jig a little and I haven't got a bite. It's another good one. Good fish. Man. That's another, that's got to be three, three plus. Get any bigger and I'll have to get the scale out. So two fish so far. Well, three if you want to cut to count the small largemouth. So three fish so far and they're all largemouth so far. It's just, you never know, every day is different. Would I have caught that fish on the top water? I don't know. They wouldn't hit the jig this morning. It's just every day's a little bit different. Another largemouth. <laughs> Check it out. Oh, he's got me around a tree. Or a rock or something. Oh boy. Oh geez. I hope I can land this one. It's a big one. It's a big one. Ah, that's what I was afraid of. Darn it. Jumped and jumped and threw the hook, man. That is disappointing. It was a big one. Man, how many how many good fish am I gonna lose today? I pinched the barbs down on my hooks, so uh, when I'm worm fishing. So you do lose one here and there, but not not very often. Boy, that was a big fish there. <laughs> oh well. Pretty sure it was a big old spot. I'll catch more. So if you learn nothing else from my videos, you need to learn that you should never overlook a Texas rig worm. Everybody else is throwing a shaky head or or out drop shotting or whatever. I stick with this, the old school Texas rig. And it works. Interestingly, they would not hit a jig today so, so far. Flip him in here. That's a large mouth. Isn't that awesome? Isn't that weird? Every fish so far has been a large mouth. Come on. That's another nice chunk. Pound and a half, two pounds. Oh, that was an awkward hook set. <laughs> Another fish about twice the size of this one following him. Come on, fish. It's a little spot. Again, I, I came up into the creek, a creek 
on the north side of the or north end of the lake. It's a pretty consistent pattern. You just got to figure out what they want. And they didn't want the jig today, which is unusual. Mouth. Odd that they're mostly large mouths today. Another decent large mouth. I mean, he's a pound and a half, maybe. Knew he. Knew there was one there. Still interesting to me that there's so many large mouths. All right, thanks for tuning in. Wasn't the day I hoped for. I did catch a couple of good large mouths. Mostly large mouths today. Uh, <clears throat> you're gonna hit a slow day every once in a while. There's a lot of guys out here pre-fishing for a big tournament that's gonna happen this weekend. But uh, thanks for tuning in. Give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Make sure you tune in for the next episode.